Revelation 1803, from the 6th of February 1941. Connections from Earth to the Beyond in Maturity There should be no ambiguity about the fact that only the spiritually advanced human being can establish contact with otherworldly forces with the result that divine wisdom and unlimited knowledge is imparted to him. If connections with the beyond are established without the necessary spiritual maturity, then such opportunities likewise benefit the mature beings of the beyond, and the success is conscious and unconscious deception by bad and ignorant forces. Such connections can only be warned against, for they neither bring spiritual advantage to people nor to the beings of the beyond but are a great danger to them. People may call upon good spiritual strength at any time for protection, for help and also for mental instruction. And they will always be ready for the earthly children. But then the silent call in thought is also sufficient. But if the human being seeks to establish a visible connection with the expectation that the otherworldly powers will express themselves recognizably, then a certain spiritual maturity is a prerequisite that knowing powers will now make themselves known, and indeed the powers will express themselves which are desired and called upon by the knowledge-hungry earth child. Spiritually immature people have no desire for pure, truth but only seek information about earthly questions and their whole desire for knowledge only consists of finding out as much as possible about earthly life, about the future and about earthly successes. And thus such wishes are granted by likewise earthly-minded beings of the beyond. Understandably, however, such communications cannot result in success for the soul and therefore they would be better left undone if they did not stimulate the human being to think about the continuation of life after death and the actual task during earthly existence. Then such connections can also signify an advantage for the soul, providing the human being does not immediately reject such thoughts but they are now the cause for the human being to go into himself and change his life accordingly. Then such a carelessly established connection will also have borne blessings if the human being then seriously establishes a mental connection with the good, knowing forces, since he now believes in them and calls upon them in fullest faith in their working. Amen.